Good evening, classmates. Good evening, Dr. Adolfo, PhD, EDD. Okay, um, introduction about the, ca the castle by Franz Kafka. It is an unfinished novel written in 1922. So, if I am going to say about um, the castle, so how are you going to assist yourselves? What is the castle all about? So, is it okay, sir, that I'm going to ask them about the um, definition? Okay, the castle is an unfinished novel written in 1922 by Franz Kafka, a British author. Me, sir. The author died and the story was finished, but published by other different authors. It doesn't tackle the new things of expand to our areas and thoughts. It is such great incidents sort of Incidents that the that the authors, some of the authors, critic about the um, the castle that there is no climax, there is no exposition, there is no evolution, there is no falling action, there is no denouement or conclusion sometimes. But I strongly believe that uh, the story or the novel cannot be a novel without a plotting. Okay, since I am talking about the castle, so. Let me rephrase the, the happenings about the castle. First, when he was um, when he was arrived into the village, he was shocked and <clears throat> feel that there's something strange in that particular place. Then after that, um, he was um, gazing about the about the top of the mountain, about the house. <coughs> And he was suddenly, um, he was suddenly <clears throat> say to himself that there might, there might be a trouble, a darkness of the castle. That uh, inside of the village there was a castle. That during the time was arrived, there was a, a, a the, the the whole village was covered by uh, with the snow. So that's it. That's the that's the exposition there. Then the evolution there is. Um, Excuse me, before you proceed to the evolution, I want you to give us the abstract. I the uh, abstract. Oh, sorry, I'm not yet done, sir. Okay. After that, um, he's struggling about the struggling about the people, the villagers. No the need for you to sense. give the details. I said in six sentences, but the six sentences are enough so there's for you for to me, explain sir, to summarize the, for the, the abstract. Whole story. So you want me to? It's more than a to, summary. To, to just only is a more, a more than summary. Just a, uh, abstract. A very important event. Uh, just like event. the event will be put yes, together sir, yes. into six sentences. Okay. And that first, is abstract. Um, arrived uh, into the village. Then of course he was a stranger there. Then after that uh, <coughs> he um, he managed himself into uh, like a, a stranger. Then third, um, he was being with he was being with Frida, was the mistress of Clown. Then Mr. Clown is the highest um, is the is the highest official of the castle. Then um, the the entire story was um, was bring back or I mean I mean um, <laughs> tackling uh, tackling about their. Um, about their past and what was the happening inside the village. Then six is um, K. K died. K died because of because of what is um, because of the because of the the salvation. It's I know that this topic, this subject, this subject is not uh, a literary criticism, but I think it's not appropriate for you to count. For the abstract, just like summarizing or encapsulating only very important events, yes, but uh, you should not count because counting is not uh, a part of your sharing with us the way you share with us the abstract in six sentences. So I think you can give directly the the summary. It's a more it's more than a summary to complete the six sentences for the abstract. I don't know, but I have to correct you because uh, for me, that is not the way you deliver your abstract. 
Okay, sir, first. Um, no, 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 do not count. Ah, okay, sir. <laughs> Sorry for that. You can, by counting itself verbally, you can only think it yourself. But you are still counting. Oh, no, no, sorry. do not sorry, count. Sorry. <laughs> 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 he arrived at the village. He arrived at the village. That, uh, he arrived at the village. Then... Okay, sir. He took himself alone and observing the village or what is happening at the village. Then he was a surveyor. And being a surveyor during that time is um, including the property, um, surveying the property of the villagers or or the, the houses of course. Then um, he met the Ahmed uh, Freda, which is the, the mistress of Glam, Glam's mistress, I mean. And um, he realized that everything must everything must <coughs> Must follow, follow completely what what was planning during that time. Then he was um, he was being um, frustrated, frustrated because the the castle that he really wants to during that time to live in was um, was a great disappointment. That would be all, for, sir. Thank you. Okay, so I guess I am going to I'm going to, uh, <coughs> to proceed to the planning of this story. Uh, the exposition, of course, um, uh, but the very beginning of the story, um, he he arrived at the uh, in the village with um, with a full with a village was was covered was covered on snow for during that time. Then evolution there is just one belief that um, that would be. Uh, the <clears throat> the <clears throat> contrary between man man and society of course then the climax there when she when she fell in love with Frida Plum's uh, mistress the following action was um, he he failed he failed to to uh, <clears throat> he failed to divert divert Frida's feelings then the dilemma there um, the dilemma there, um, everything is, everything is, <clears throat> is um, complicated, complicated because of the, because of the system, systems of the, the officials in the, in the village. The conclusion there, um, he, he was not succeed, uh, he didn't succeed. Uh, he didn't su success about the about his plan about his about his plan to to get into the country. excuse me I was con confused with the denouement and the conclusion what is the difference between between the two you mentioned already the denouement a while ago and then uh, after that you also mentioned conclusion which one the denouement is also part of, of the, the resolution uh, yeah yes, of the resolution of the story. It can be a sad, uh, they say, sad, it sir. can be a yeah. sad, they say, ending part. Ending part, yes, sir. Or a happy ending. It's up to you how you end Stop talking, please. up with your story. That Your conclusion is the... The conclusion there was, um, <clears throat> K, K was, uh, <clears throat> K died, sir. K died because um, uh, he was frustrated and really disappointed. Disappointed about about his intention to live in into the castle. Was it tragic? No, sir. It was not stated in the story. Okay. You may continue with your report. Anyway, it's still on British and American literature. Yes, I won't interrupt you if there are other details that you want to share with us in your report. Continue that. Then later, your classmates will ask you questions. Continue. They have. Uh, I don't know, so you only have your parts, the plotted parts yes, of the sir, story. I mean the, After the that, no more. Approach, so are you now ready for the questions, if that is the case? Yes, 
Yes, sir. So there's no need for you to explain more of your report. Yes, sir. Just Maybe to I rephrase, I, I think I, I, I want you to rephrase or restate or say it again about the abstract. It seems that I, I get um, confused. I, I A while ago, as I was listening, I was not able to understand well because you were <coughs> counting and it seems that if you were counting, I, I, I could not understand more. I think there's no need for you to come. Say something uh, about your abstract without even reading everything. Just only face your classmates and share with us in six sentences. First, um, no, no, do not I say first. <laughs> after that, uh, uh, after the, the abstract, Kindly also encapsulate your parts of the story under the technical analysis. You have the technical analysis, but yes, no, there's no need for you to say exposition, uh, involution, or climax. You have to continue that. Just say that the, the characters, blah, 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 because we understand that the, the characters belong to the exposition, the, even the setting, the, the time, right? The language. But when you say uh, conflict, between, we understand that, but there's yes, no need for you to mention conflict, involution. Just continue sharing that with us in a nutshell. So, so you arrived into the village uh, with, uh, with a full snow, the village is full of snow, we're covered with snow. We stood into the wooden wood, into the which kitchen. Which end uh, is, is the, uh, the place there. And he, he was, <coughs> was um, starting to think about the journey that, uh, that is going to, to adopt into the village. And he met Frida. Frida was Dominic's mistress and helped him a lot about the, about the, <coughs> about the strategy, the systems in the village. And he really pursued his intention to let into the castle by pursuing and by pursuing to get into the castle. He was frustrated and died <coughs> because he didn't make the the salvation of the freedom until they get into the castle. That would be all. Okay, the, the entire story was all about the gas, the <laughs> the castle, and the exposition there. There's no, I think there's no need for me to elaborate about the exposition because I've already um, stated it regarding the, the story. So can I have your um, can I have your um, question so that I can I can really provide you what is the story all about. Okay, so may I request uh, anyone from the class to start by asking questions to the reporter? Abisores. Um, actually, I didn't understand the, the, the story because um, uh, as you deliver up, it, it's how uh, um, I'm kind of confused. Then, kind of, uh, as you deliver the exposition or the abstract of the story, you know, we we really didn't understand what's the beginning and the end. Yeah, we really uh, uh, we don't know where, where is the settings, the uh, who are the main character. Uh, could you please give us again the uh, the abstract of the story in uh, when, where, and what is the place? I think there's no need for to. But, but you are obliged to, for clarification. You are obliged to so where, to where give. Did, where is the main part that you really confused about the report? Everything I really didn't understand. Uh, so not only not only the spot, not only the part. Try only everything. your best to recall. Yes, but maybe. everything. Yes. If you That's can do that I by really recalling everything. everything. No, if you can recall everything, but you have to make sure that the time we only spend uh, one hour here. Yes, Try your best to um, the say something. There is in the village. I mean, was in the village, of course. Then into the 
the uh, gentleman's in, the landlady's in, the bridge in. So that's it. So let me ask her sir, if she really understood about what, about about the the things that. That I what she said a while ago about the exposition, uh, the characters, because she was not able to understand who were the the protagonist and the antagonist, the round characters, in other words, and the flat characters, and even the setting of the story, because she failed, I think, to listen to you, or maybe you failed to mention also the, the nah, setting yes, of the story. Okay, first, um, I am sorry. He, um, he arrived into the village during that time. Then it was an old. Uh, um, his companion is Jeremiah, 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 and I forgot the the other one. But the the old assistants were too during that time. Then he, when he when he trying to when he, when he trying to get into the um, the castle. During that time, he was a surveyor. He was a surveyor than the villagers and the peasants and anything, anything from the society. They they didn't want him to be there as a surveyor of the village. Then after that, Plum's mistress, he met Plum, um, he met Plum mistress into the club, into the club, then. Then Frida, the plum's mistress, her name is Frida, and she uh, helped him through a lot of struggle, through a lot of um, journey, travel, while staying into the village. And after that, um, he was being um, frustrated, frustrated because of the happening into the village because he can't really get into the castle because the officials there was um, very, very strict because in primitive during that time the, the law the law was um, was um, took for granted during that time so I guess or based <coughs> on the story it was really stated there that you must really to follow the rules and regulations that have been implemented by the castle towards you and after that again the hope and the the goal, the the intention to be with into the castle was was futile, was useless. Futile is useless. Then that's the time we realized that the salvation, the freedom to get into the castle, was already dead. Okay, so Lavisores, are you contented with the explanation of the reporter? If you're not contented, so you have to provide, you have to also to add. No, okay. Other question? The reporter is ready now to accept questions from the class. Do you have question? Our guest, we have our guest here, student from the other subject. Yes, uh, Ms. Gales, do you have something to add? on behalf of the reporter or you would like also to say something just to clarify also the explanation given to us by the reporter. Okay. As what I've understood, um, the story doesn't have its, it's not, it is not, um, it is not uh, a normal story that you can read in any, um, in, story. Any, in any story that you can find. Um, so, so could you please explain how does it differ from any other stories that we read, that we you that read? We usually read, read about the story. Okay, um, <clears throat> the castle, the castle, of course, what comes in your mind is the structure, the old structure of the village. So we're expecting that um, the, the castle was on the village is the, the, um, the foundation, the foundation of all villagers, but it was not. It was not. Because the castle there is the, the freedom. The freedom, the goals, the intention, the, the, it symbolizes that. It symbolizes a man's freedom that he really, want, what, that he really wants to, to have in his life. If we will go deeper about the castle, the castle there was not really, what, not really stated about the, the, 
not that is not a structure that is not like that so i just want you to know that this is a see a self explanatory that the castle is okay so, the castle all about. so is, is that enough you want to explain I, more? I really want to to, to profound more sir, about the, okay. the castles in order for them to understand okay. what is the castle all about. Okay. Okay. Let me say for example, if you really want that thing, of course you must sacrifice. You must to pay pay something to yourself. Uh, I mean to to allocate something to yourself that you can um, you can grab that thing that you really want in your life. The sacrifice, the goals. The intention, the direction, perseverance, the struggle, the journey itself. It might be um, useful of doing those things so that you can have your freedom. Okay, so Ms. Sagales, are you contented with the explanation? Or only the explanation is only partly being answered being to you? Discussed. Yeah, being discussed. Um, uh, I would like to know the role of, of K. Um, the protagonist in the story. Yeah, protagonist. Um, as you said, this, the castle there is, is not a structure, but um, it's a symbolic structure oh, that uh, symbolizes the person's yeah. goal, the person's desire. Right. So, um, what symbolizes K in the story? Based on my understanding regarding the story, because since we have basis, um, the the symbolize of the uh, the the symbol. I mean the symbol, the K symbol uh, <laughs> of the story. Of course, um, you really want to you really want to for me to for me just for me. Uh, you really want to have a a good life. Um, a one of the really wants to. Uh, to have a family in the village, into the village together with Frida, and his desire also is to to is to have a good work, a good work into the entire village, so that uh, by having a good work or having a work, of course, you can have the chance to make a family. Okay, that's all. Is that enough? Are you satisfied with my answer, Miss Jenny Sagales? How about the struggle of K in this? Answer directly to the question of Ms. Agales about the, yes, the simplest. Yeah. Uh, that is why I'm asking her sir, if she is satisfied with my answer. Uh, so, mean, so meaning that you, you hit the yes, I, question. I, I have something to tell about K. Okay. Okay. The struggle, of course, the struggle there was uh, very painful if I were to speak uh, regarding the case condition or situation from the story. Then it will also lead him to the janitor. So, ja being a janitor from the the school, sir, into the village, because he was applying because the the officials uh, from the castle um, were uh, re rejected him as one of their employee, maybe that a sort of. Okay, okay. Other students, William, it's your turn now. Uh, excuse me. I think that is not a good. Uh, that is not a good candidate that you're going to ask Mr. Nelson. Okay, will you please stand up, okay. William? So, can you please um, state the evolution or the, the complication of the story and why? Or can you please uh, support, su support some events that happened during the story that you can say that is the evolution of the story? That's what I'm also going to ask questions regarding uh, yes, uh, the same, course, yeah, regarding I the question I of William. Be, I can be already answered. Okay, good. Okay, of course, the evolution there was um, everything, that's what I have told about the story. Everything, everything. It, uh, now I mean the society, the society, matter of society, like that. Because everything on the village, uh, they don't like him when um, when he entered the the village. Because as what I have um, read about the story, of course he was a stranger. Then visiting the the uh, the the, <clears throat> the village, of course. Then the involution there. I could say by myself, but I could also choose two, two involution. But for me, if I were to to ask, of course, he asked me about the involution. For me, man versus man. Why man versus man? Because the these the, the things there. Every chapter that I that I've read about the the castle was not really um, not really. 
good for me to understand, but um, the, the character, the, the some characters there, I, I mean all the characters there except Freda, Freda and Olga, um, that the, the situation, the, 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 um, I mean the, the conversation, the conversation um, is not really good. Uh, I am referring to the landlady, the landlord, the clowns, um, the Sordini, Sordini, one of the one of the characters that I am. That, that is why you yes, came sir. up with the conclusion yes, that it's about man versus man. Uh, yes, sir. Because the conversation there, you can really feel the conversation. That every chapter was was not good towards the protagonist. Okay, may I request Villar if. You, if there is something doubt or you can refer to the reporter if you have also read the entire story if you, if you knew already what was that story all about well um i am concerned with the information but now i am questioning about the, the point of view mm -hmm. okay the point of view that about the story i know that you are prepared to answer that yes of course sir <laughs> Of course. I mean, the point of view, sir, is um, if you really want to have something in your life, of course, so you must set everything on your mind, like mind sitting, like that. But of course, patience, desire. But we're talking about we literature, huh? Yes, sir. No, but I can support all. Okay, those okay. Are going to ask okay, me we have to wait. Question, sir. I, I mean about those, those, um, those answers. Okay. That's it, sir. That that is the the point of view. The point of view again. Again, regarding those um, answers, the the um, the uh, the explanation, or I mean the the freedom of yourself to the freedom of yourself and uh, you have forgotten though, about yes, the sir. points of view in literature, the first person point first of view, person second person of, person point of view, and the third per person point of view. I asked already, already that last time to yes, you. Sir. Okay, will but you please? Story, sir, was yeah, that you have to relate that to the point of view. The point of view. Yeah, the first person point of view, th second person point of view, or third second person point of view. view so, what is this all about? What point of view that the, the author used in the story? Is it second person point of view, or third person point of view, omniscient, or limited point of view? Of course, I, for me, sir, um, uh, I saw what <laughs> the story uh, the the point of view there uh, I, I really um, you know what is the third person sir. point of view yes, the sir. narrator that, the last time, is narrating yeah yeah narrating the story about yeah. the castle yes sir yes sir and i can say that it's not limited omniscient omniscient i mean omniscient. Uh, is that also a first yes, person point of view uh, because you told me before that omniscient is all knowing yeah but with, since we're all knowing about the characters especially k Yes, I could also say sir, it's not also it's not also the first person point of view. Yeah, you know, yes, sir. it begins with I, person, I, sir, blah blah person. blah. It should be I. No, it's not I. Person, since because um, the 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 entire story was not really um, uh, focusing to to K, but also to the other to another person. So third person yes, sir, lim it's limited. It's all knowing. It's omniscient. All, all, all knowing. Yes, sir. Are you contented? Um, can you please? Support the support as you are referring to the third point of view. Can you please support the specific uh, event that have happened during this story that is under uh, third point of view? Mm -hmm. I can have a question again because I think you're eating words so that I can really understand. Okay, okay repeat, yeah. Villar. Okay. I think um, my question is very simple. Ah, you, yes. You've mentioned that this is a third point of view, but I'm now asking you can you please su support a specific event? That happened to us. That's, uh, that that took place on the story where it, it it falls under third point of view. Okay, I think it's very clear now. Uh, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. When the time, when all the times, when all the time into the village, into the gentleman, gentle, gentleman's inn, the landlady, the uh, I mean the bridge inn, the 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 point of view. Uh, I mean the the site. I mean the site there. The gentleman, gentleman's inn, the bridge inn, and the, um, the 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 entire village, I swear. Because the story there was uh, happened. Okay, so, would you like to make a follow-up question, I William? I am asking about the specific event. Um, what I'm referring to is the exact uh, the, the, the events, the, the, the stories, the lines, or the, the words itself of what happened that it falls under the point of view. Okay. Specific event in the under the third person point of view. Now, if you think that uh, 
You need somebody, also your classmates no, to... No, sir, I think I can answer those questions, sir, because... Okay, I very good. I like that. Okay, you have a you fighting spirit, a burning yourself. spirit, as a Visayanian. The lines. The lines. Yeah, the lines. I am willing to sacrifice myself, Frida, just to be with you forever. I? Do you think I? Is it I? No, I am just... Um, ah, referring to you. Just referring but myself. just but copy. No, Is copy it. Copy it. Quote, uh, quote. It was quoted. Yes. Quoted. Uh, quoted. Okay, you quoted. quoted. Uh, How do you repeat that by quoting what has been said in yes. the, uh, the in the, the third yes, person okay. point of view? Yes, third person. Okay. So you want me to write, sir, or you want me to narrate by myself? Yeah, narrate. So no, no, yes. quote. Do not narrate quote yes. what has been written okay. there. <laughs> okay, told Frida told Frida to be with him forever because he believed that even though there's a lot of, of challenges, struggles, and pain hardships that they encountered into the village, they can be together. Okay, did you get now the third person point of view? Uh, yes. Said, but then I have a follow-up question about the theme of the story. Can you please expound about the theme of the story? And uh, please support answer, to, uh, please support explanation to your answer. Okay, another one. So the theme of this story. The theme of the story is um, dramatic. Dramatic. Why is it and dramatic? Why? Oh. why? Because since we, are, we go deeper, just because it's a literature, a literary criticism, yes, you can have your own interpretation about the story, but you must. You must to base on the story, of course, since we're talking about the story of the castle. Let's say, for example, the theme of the story was all about. The, the life of the man, uh, a struggle, a desire to have a, a complete life just to be with uh, someone you really loved. Just give only a word or phrase, phrase. For, for the theme. Desire. Okay. Desire, for, desire, for, desire for someone who really loved forever. I mean, no, it's a sentence already. Desire of, desire of the man. Okay, desire of the man is your theme. Yes, sir. Can you explain that theme, desire for a man? Yes, and the desire of the man, sir, uh, why I can say that because, um, um, yes, everyone has desire. <laughs> this desire is to have freedom. Freedom, again, we're talking about freedom. Desire, I mean, <clears throat> the patience just to have the, the, the one that you really loved forever. That's it. Then, um, the, um, the, <clears throat> the situation, the situation that how are you going to assist yourself if you're going to, if you're going to propose that, uh, propose that um, feelings towards okay. someone. Other questions? Ovilliar again. Okay, so in studying literature, we, we, we go deeper, as you said. Yes. I want you to apply the three levels of interpretation. Um, based on your story. Ah, so okay, that in that. Uh, Although that there, there the is a uh, no, there is an up. Yeah. And the, um, what is this the is about um, British and American literature, but uh, he wants also to. He has to apply also in liter literary criticism because this is also a, a lit literature. This is a story, so yes. can you be able to interpret? Based on lateral uh, level, the is about the man's um, confidence, man's um, determination. Excuse me, can you please, um, can you please uh, uh, cite the lateral, the, the metaphorical, and the evaluative level of interpretation? I think I can, I can do that in the same time. Let me finish first the the, the interpretation level or the interpretative level, so that. I okay, start first with uh, literal level. level. That is level. the the basic one yeah, level. Yeah. The basic level, so the literal basic level. basic level about the story, of course, sir, the, the interpretative level. So how are you going to... No, 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 no. I said interpretative level is the same as metaphorical level. It's on the, 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 the second, second stage, the second stage yeah, now. The, the first stage is first literal. Stage literal. Second stage is metaphorical or interpretative level. And the third one, the last one, is evaluative level. That is the time for you to start with the real reaction, the positive reaction, and the negative reaction. The, um, for me, the, the, uh, the symbol there, the, the castle. Okay, you start with the lateral level. Any, you only choose any part there of the story wherein you can also quote. You can also quote. Why? Then you tr 
after quoting yes after quoting the quoted part of the story then I'm going to I am going symbolize to, that connote to simplify to, you, you connote you express that yeah, the, how I'm going to, to assess yeah yes the castle why again why because everybody thinks about what is the castle the villagers the, the landlady the all characters there but Yes, sir. The, the, the castle. Literal. That is why I'm explaining. Now, no, no. Literal. Should you have to quote? Quote. Uh, yes. Um, yes. Quoting, quoting is what has been written there by the author should be should be reiterated by you by quoting what has been said by the author. The castle. What, what, just like what you did a while ago. You yes, say that. The castle. The, the castle is in the, the deep part of the village that no one yet entering that castle. Okay, by doing that, by basing on the literal level, you have to interpret that. Oh, what is the meaning of that? What you said, yes. based on that quote, Why? quoted part, that Why? explanation. Because yeah. As a, um, as based a, on that, what, yes, based, on that quotation. On that, yes, sir. <coughs> as a villagers, as a um, people, as a community there, so no one can find what is a castle because uh, as what I have said Is that the symbolism? The is that the connotation? Uh, yes, sir, the castle, sir, because that, that is a part. It's, it falls under metaphorical, sir. Oh yeah, metaphorical. But we're still on the natural interpretation. You have to... to I think... You try, okay. You try to explain. Would you like to correct or explain? To add? No, explain, sir. I can. Yeah, wait, wait. We uh, will listen to your classmate first. You, you can re react that yeah, later. Yes, okay. You can react uh, that. What I understood is that on the literal part, he already quoted um, yes. that the castle is in the middle of... It should be clear. Uh, you have to yes, make sir, it I, clear. I, I say clear. I was not able to understand it well because uh, I don't know if the, you are following what has been said or you are just only rephrasing that yourself. That, that was no, the... No, not, not uh, sure. Okay, wait. It was quoted. Okay, so what did you say? Uh, that was that was he said a while ago. He quote um, kindly quote it again so yes, that everyone the, the castle the castle inside the village mm -hmm. is um, no one can no one has been there. Okay, that's it. Yes, sir. for the literal level. For literal. literal level. How are you but able to? Okay, letter. how are you able to come up with your interpretation or with the oh, symbolism that to, to that to that particular quote part? Yes, of, of very good. Sir. Okay. So you go? Yes, I would you like just, to just say something? Just okay, say something, say something first. The, oh. the, okay, uh, the, the quoted part. Reporter is that uh, from the quoted part, since mm -hmm. the castle is yes, in the yes. middle of the village, wherein nobody was able to yeah. go there, I guess he was about to begin. He was about to explain that um, uh, on the point of view of the villagers and, and the point of view of the people around, uh, the castle is nowhere to be found because it is um, it is a symbol. It is a symbol of our desire, of our longing, of our goals. I think that was the interpretation. Yes, that is my. Interpretation. Would you like to react to the to that, Villar, or you are contented? I think so. If we were about to say, uh, if we were interpreted, well, and we will, we will, we will, we will, we will combine it with the word symbols. It falls under metaphorical. Yes. But we're just after literal, sir. We're not yet under metaphorical. But excuse me, sir, to interrupt this. Um, yeah, 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 okay. Sir, because since you're oh, asking about the. Wait, wait, just, just listen wait. first off. Sir, to be defended by the report, of okay. course. I am the reporter. Here. Uh, of course, you knew uh, everything, yes. of course. Uh, yes, of you course, have to defend that. You, ask, you, uh, you are being asked about the. the, um, the the uh, metaphorical, yeah. of course, of course, you say metaphorical, so you know what is metaphorical to me? Yeah, that's it. Yes, that's the, 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 yes, the symbol, of oh. course. So I am quoted already about this story. Mm -hmm. Then I was about to, I was about to, about to ask again. The metaphorical that, level to yes, what you, you yes, have the said part, in the quoted course, part. The metaphorical level, then again, literal meaning. No, the, that, I am the quoted to, part to for me is the literal, literal yes, the yes, literal sir. part. The quoted, so, the quoted yes, part. The quoted part. Yeah. The quoted part. After that quoted part, you have to start also explaining by metaphorical, metaphorical level. Metaphorical yeah. level. Symbolism why? now, why? the figurative yeah. language. Yeah. yeah. That, that was already said. 
Kindly repeat what you said. <laughs> so, okay, you are the reporter, right? You are the reporter. Um, the, the desire, the goal, or something like that. So it symbolizes the desire. So the inside of the village there symbolizes the desire, the goals. Yes, sir. Then you want me to explain into a symbolism. I That's it. It's enough. Yeah, you say no. that it symbolizes the desire, the, the, desire, the goal. Yes, if true. you would like to add also Villar about what you have also learned, of course about the story, you can also do that. Would you like to, to because, add? Uh, ah, yes. I think, sir, the, the, the quoted part that he used is he used in other lateral and he used in other metaphorical. Okay, so it should not be. It should not be. I um, think, uh, if you quote something for the lateral, the, the other metaphorical, you will use another goal. But I think she is also. Is, I think she, what she said a while ago. I think that's already the metaphorical now. But for you, but for me, sir, they, he misinterpreted it by by, by about you. Yeah, yeah. The same lines because. Yeah, that's it. That's why because I I I asked Sagales also to explain that and. Villar also content. Uh, well, yeah, of course, he was contented yes. with what but, Sagales. Um, but he wants spent. more about. He but wants more from me. Yeah. Another, another oh, another another God. oh, what is that? <laughs> it's not accepted. That oh, that's it. Okay, so questions? Yes, Villar. Okay. What about you there? Excuse me. So if no one will ask questions, I think it's, it's a big, you know, it's, it's not good. It's a big shame on us that our guest the student will be the one to dominate us by asking questions. It's not good. Yes, sir. So my students, hurry up, Davisores. How about the others? Ulysses. You. Can you stand up, please, because that is not informal. In the motive metaphorical, can you ask that thing, the important event, or the point of view? I think we're just repeating what I Point of view, metaphorical, just only ask only one question. Excuse me, sir. I think, I think sir, that, that, is that, that is not that good. That is not good. Wait, wait. wait. Let, let her finish. Okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. I I chose, yes, William, do you have because something my, to say? My question before her was mm. not yet finished because I think there's no way for the definition. Oh, yeah. Okay, so kindly. Okay. Okay. Yes? Try, try, do not. No, 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 do not. Oh, so you mean it is your task. It is your task to explain, to expound on your story. Evaluative level. You have not yet done with evaluative level. Reaction. So. What? The positive reaction, the negative reaction, the rea reaction. Oh, oh yeah, you have that. What is your question? Okay, again. Again. Act again? Are you using the word act? Yes, sir. Oh, what do you mean by act? Oh, Frida, I want to be with you forever. Uh, maybe this this is one way of testing you if you are a good dramatist or not. Yes. Maybe uh, your classmates. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, Frida. Okay, wait. Just oh, I think he's going to act now. To act out. Okay. So can I use? Try to recall the act. Can I use uh, body language? Can I have? Yeah, that's it. Everything. Okay. Oh, Frida. I really want to to spare my life with you, just to be with you forever. I don't care about the challenges, the struggles that we've been uh, that we encounter. May I think we encounter maybe while we are starting our journey to be forever. Okay, are you contented now? Yes, I just want to ask what is the format? What is that? Format. Format for? I think it is. is it? He's only acting out what you've been asking format for. Because I. Okay, stand up. What format? format? Even me, I, I was not able to also to understand. I, I got confused. Okay, the form. Use the form. This is literature. Use the form. No, no form. What form? 
What drama. form? Drama. Yes. Okay, this is a drama. Why? I think, already I think uh, you say that well. I, I don't have choice, but I have to say it. To, to say Clearly, it just to. Yes, so say it again so in order for them to understand. Yeah. Okay. A drama. Yes, you can. Drama because, in a few words. Drama is a drama because of what? Because of the because the of the happenings of um Kay's journey. Okay. Kay's journey together with Frida, since Frida is a mistress, mistress of Tom, then that's that. I guess um it is understandable for them. Yeah. And, and I think maybe they are now. This is what we call on the spot reporting and on the spot asking, asking questions, questions and asking questions that beyond. Yeah. The limitation of the reporter. But yes. But I, you try your best, I of course. Best, but yeah. I, I did answer well. Of course. Uh, as I say that, this is on the spot, you know, reporting, on the spot asking questions. Yes, and do you do not expect that the, the, the same type of question, it should be different kinds of yes, questions. Different questions yeah. That, uh, that I can, I, I can just imagine. Try it also to answer all the questions. Yes, sir. I don't have choice. Yeah. Can you please continue to the evaluative interpretation? Okay, evaluative level. The positive reaction and the negative reaction. The negative reaction. Yeah. About the, about the, the, the story, story and story. even, about the story and even the author. The author, about yeah. the author about the story. In general. In general. In general. So both. Yeah. Because both are general maybe. <laughs> you have to explain that. It is your task. <laughs> Okay, the castle for me, the castle is about the 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 interpretation of human's desire. I, I mean, of man's desire. That is for the positive uh, yes, side. Yes, the positive side, but um, but negative side regarding the story. Uh, I I am not really convinced with the this the settings because um, <clears throat> the the when the struggle comes to to kid's life. And to Frida as well. The, How about Franz the, Kafka? The, the, uh, I'm not yet done with Francis. Okay. So I am just explaining about the content. The, the, the content. I mean, mm. I mean about the castle first. This is the negative side about the story. Then the the ending there was not really stated, but uh, it was stated there that the the hope, the hope and the the passion just to get into the castle was not really clearly. Um, <coughs> approach by the the author that if i am going to i am going to um to give a a critic about the masterpiece about the masterpiece of franz kafka regarding the story yeah the past you want me to give the positive side or you want me to to first say the negative side continue it's up to you okay the negative side the negative side there the story was unfinished Yes, the story was unfinished, and the, the some some of the the, the store uh, some of the um, settings there are not are not um, are not applicable in our daily life. Just for me, the what about the side, author? But the yes, sir, I am referring to the author, sir. Okay. His masterpiece. I am only the content that you are yes, referring sir, to. Then about what about the the, the, the author past. himself? About the author himself, is he gay? Is he? Um, uh, what? For me, sir, uh, you can be a Is good he author, a dramatist, a playwright? Author if you have a self determination, yeah. passion, love, of course, the agony, the despair. Because, in my own understanding about, about the author, about the author, you can be an author without those things in your mind, in your heart, and your totality as an author. Okay. Other students? Okay, another follow up question. Um, in your story, why did you apply psychological and theological approach? Oh. Give me an exact event. To prove that it is in a psychological and So there is now an application of of the, the critical analysis, analysis, analysis. The, the approach. literary criticism yes, 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 approach. Okay, the psychological approach is the, the gentleman's in, whereas the landlady landlady ask um ask Frida that don't go don't go with don't go with uh, um the stranger. I mean the K. I'm referring to K because K is a stranger during that time that. Then uh, the landlady really cared so much uh, to Frida. I mean, for the entire life of Frida, the landlady really cared for her. Contented. Then no, I guess I am not yet done with my explanation. Then, then if I, if you were if you were to if you were to um, to be um, 
to be the uh, to be the the character as as the the you're captivating the the um, the totality of Frida. So would you dare to would you dare to believe her, Jinan Lily, that to believe her that to to influence you or to asking you not to go with with the man you love? So this is a this is a, um, a very very clever decision that you're going to that you are going to um, analyze or you're going to decide because you know the consequence, the result. So what if, though we know that, um, that, that K is a surveyor, surveyor that time is um, including the, the property, your assist, your auditing the property, the, the, the land area, like that, then how are you going, um, how can you sure, how are you going to guarantee your life that you, you really want to go with that man? So are you sure? It's it's analysis. How are how are you going to assist yourself if you're going to if you're going to be with him forever without assurance that he can he can um, he can give you life. Okay, so Lavisores, are you contented with the explanation of the reporter? Um, how about in a uh, excuse me, can you stand up, please? Okay. Sorry. Uh, how about in a Sorry, theological? Why did you apply it? The theological. So, so um, about the story. So, um, some of the uh, various uh, from the stories are. Um, um, we can also say that there's a biblical interpretation or a biblical um, religion. So for that. Sorry, because the, the, the messenger there, the messenger of um, K, K's messenger is Barnabas. And uh, do you still uh, remember? So can I have the introduction sir, about um, Barnabas? Yeah, yeah. Into the, into the Bible, yeah. based, based on the Bible. So can I ask Tracy, sir, to... She was the one asking you that question, right? Uh, so yes, would you like to turn it back to her? <laughs> yes, I would like to okay. if she knows uh, Barnabas okay. in the Bible. I'm sorry, she... I don't know. Oh, okay, I am contented for that. So, okay, the Barnabas was, um, do you still remember? Recap, recap about the religious, but I don't have a, enough time to, to explain about the, about but try, the Bible. But try only to I explain. I try my best to, to recap. Just only the to recap important about events. The, the, about the Pontius Pilate. Yeah, Pontius everybody Pilate knew that. Pilate yeah, yeah. Oh, Pilato. <laughs> no, 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 no.